Everyone glimpsed here, and today Arlecchino is finally here. Arlecchino, Arlecchino, it doesn't really matter. I've been saying Arlecchino, so that's what we're going to keep it at. So, I'm about a 50 pity on this this banner in general, and I'm like zero pity on this. So, no 50-50s, nothing guaranteed. Let's hope. I mean, I, I want the weapon for the drip. You should probably go for C1. I haven't looked too much into it. We'll go over that a little bit later. I want some Lynette cons. Oh, there you go. Okay. Um, C6 is... Basically, you can kind of play as a DPS. Will I build it right now? No, but I think it'd be cool to have that as like a future option to work towards. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. No 50-50. So let's see. That's a little early. What's that? Like, wait, what was it 50? So that means this is like almost 70. It's actually not that early. That's fine. Come on. Oh, yeah, we got, oh, right. we got the Harbinger merch right here with Child. We forgot our lucky mitt that we used already. Dude, that, that lucky med's not it. <laughs> it's really not been working, guys. That's fine. Uh, yeah, it doesn't... Uh, yeah, guys, that that's not a great sign. Okay, well, at least we're getting Lynette cons, I guess. Wow. Okay. Um, oh, there you go. Nice. <laughs> that was early. What was that? 30, 40, 30? I don't know. Let's see how early it was in this. Okay, there you go. That's a pretty sick animation. Got the eclipse thing in the background. These heels are cool, too. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um... Could that have gone a little better? Y yeah. But, we can't complain because we got her. Okay? That, that, like I'm saying, that could have gone much worse. Now, let's see. Can we pull it off in seven wishes? You see, I want to grab the mitt. Lucky mitt. But it's... <laughs> I don't know. I think, I don't, I think that's kind of not been doing great for us. And then, I do really want this weapon. Am I going to spend right now? No, because I have the pa uh, the patch just started. And there's a lot of place to explore. And I can't even use her right now this second because I still need to build everything else. But, we will be getting her weapon before the end of this patch. Probably. <laughs> okay, no guarantees guys, but I do want to make that a goal to go towards. And normally I can kind of... At least get most of the way there. Okay, we got her to... No, C3, I wasn't paying attention. Um, whenever... Uh, I, I don't really care about those right now. We'll worry about it later. Okay. Uh, yeah. Whoa, that's a lot of black tassels. Um, let's just get this to f five. No, this is not a mystery side quest. Oh, yeah, um... So we're not going to be able to build her all right now because there's a new boss, but like, comment, subscribe. You guys know the deal. If you want to uh, stick around and see me build her more, I will have a video talking about like her build more and then showing off uh, some DPS at like mid-level and higher-level investments. I do think that's normally something that's pretty interesting to try out, just because, like, is the character still a good character if you... <laughs> like, if you need every single best support in the game and like I, I run it around mess around with different teams and stuff so if you are interested in that go ahead stick around so i farmed that boss a bit and i farmed everything else beforehand okay let's see i've ran that domain a couple of times what's it <laughs> i don't know which one this hair is this one bond of life okay first off this is the only one we have so i guess we're going with this um, yeah, this one for sure. Oh, we'll level that up right now, actually. That'll be fun to do on stream. I guess video right now, I'm not streaming. <laughs> okay, look at this. This is sick, right? So let's see what we get at the bottom. We probably don't have enough material to get it up to 20. <sighs> that's a bad omen, guys. Okay, yeah, that's good. 
Unfortunately, I don't have Yulon yet, so I'm not going to be able to run the best vaporized teams. But, okay, EM, yeah, still definitely always uh, much appreciated. The crit's what we really want here. Okay, come on. Well, at least get it to 16 right now. Ah, okay. Um, <laughs> let's see if we can get it to 20. It's not ruined. It's just not an amazing piece. I mean, for day one, though, I can't complain too hard. Okay, that's a, that's a, some EM bonus there. And this is probably good for someone else. Watch this. Crit. See? Doesn't even bother us. Crit. Boom, ready? Ready? We're gonna get it to 12. <laughs> I was gonna do a strong box video, but we can push it back slightly. Crit. Look at this. Ready? Crit. Crit. Here, let's... Um, what do we have? <laughs> Dude, this will be all fodder. This piece, too. I want to keep it, but... Okay, wait. You know what? Crit. Oh, damn. That was close. Okay, that's pretty good, though. Wow. Dude, I didn't even look at those numbers. Okay, so we'll just round up here. So, like, 9, 18, and then we'll just put that on another 20. So, that's that's pretty solid, actually. Um, I mean, I don't think there's a Hydro character coming out that's going to need that, but that's cool. Um, okay. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Where... Damn, okay. Like I said, happy I got her. Sucks we lost the 50-50 again but <laughs> to a character we already have C6. That's a lot in a row. We used our luck on Chiori, even though I didn't really want her that much. Okay, let's go. What did we get her to? 60? Yeah. Now the current team... Okay, we'll put her on. Current team, we're thinking of running. Like, she's not great with free and I heard because she can't heal herself. But at the end of the day, it's also kind of like, should we just go for it? You could do like a, some electro char or over, overload, <laughs> overload teams, but hmm. I'll probably mess around with Shincho teams first, because I do really want Yalan. Damn, that mouse is loud right now. Okay, yeah, we'll just do Shincho and then we're gonna st at least start off with a um, shielder, and then it. Uh, she wants Bennett for sure. Let's. Oh, I forgot to switch my team over. <laughs> Let's see. So I think she only gets her scythe. Oh wait. Oh, never mind. It's gone. Hmm. So you can only see the scythe. Like in animations there, when you walk, you don't see it. Only, at least with her signature, you can see it when you're walking around like this. I know because I was I did the test run earlier. Um, I speed ran the quest on my phone <laughs> just because I I'm like I don't want to wait a month to farm her boss. What am I missing? Oh, gotta claim these. Oh, I should have farmed the boss. Whoa! I forgot she did that. I mean, I've never seen her do that. Okay, um, let, let's farm the boss really quickly, just so you guys can kind of get a feel. Uh, yeah, it's Fontaine. So, I fought this a couple times. Right, oh, it's down here, yeah. Um, that island quest wasn't terrible. Some parts kind of annoying, but I mean, it, it's super. You know what, chat? Let's go in and rush this with Arlecchino. Yo, that, okay, that, <laughs> that's pretty sick. Dude, I love her character design, but just, uh, they just had to, where are we at here? They just had to make her, I don't remember where I was going with that, I'm be real with you. <laughs> Come on, nope, no, give me ult. It's fine. 
no ult needed. They gave it to me too late. Okay, so you can kind of see, kind of just hangs out. You mostly want to break that shield, that I'm, the yellow thing at the bottom, I'm kind of annoying. Ignoring, let's go on so we can get the energy back. Yeah, so I, we're going to run this a few times right here while we kind of start to build here. You guys can kind of see uh, base level stuff with it. Do, okay. So how long is this video? It's already 10 minutes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, time flies when I talk to <laughs> nobody. <laughs> okay, I'll probably do a, a whole dedicated video then building her the rest of the way. I just want to at least get her up to the next ascension right now and kind of take a look at her kit here. So, let's see. I know, I remember those heels looking cool. They don't look the same as what I've seen. Okay, I think that's just her boss fight where the heels are super cool like that. But yeah, her design's really cool. If you guys haven't watched the, the thing on the, the, vi the video for her on the Genshin Impact trailer, it's like seven minutes long or something. It's an animation for a backstory. That was pretty cool. Uh, kind of like a just talks about uh like i said the backstory of such origin story type thing you you kind of see why she's called father and it's you get to see some more harbinger lore all that stuff is pretty cool let's go ahead and take a look let's do this actually mm, you know i really want to make a dedicated farming video for arlecchino um that's fine. Okay, we'll, we'll do a separate video later. First, I'll probably just go record that after this right now. Because <laughs> otherwise I'll just keep talking. Okay. Uh, yeah, so we need to farm these artifacts. What's her ratio looking like? Eight to... <laughs> okay, let's take a look at... Watch this. Crit damage, ready? I forgot I have nothing. Um... Never mind, no crit damage. We can wait on that. But yeah, worst case scenario, if we kind of want to test it out and we don't unlock her uh, pole arm yet, we can try this because I believe it's these stats that she has, just different. Uh, it's different here, and I'm pretty sure this spear is pretty good on her as well. So this is something we can try out. But I do really like the drip. This is another one that I think looks really good on her. Um, you know what? Actually, I want to. Here, I'll put on this one. I want to see how the normal attacks look on this what am I doing oh so yeah it literally just shows like the energy side no matter what it is yeah not the greatest fan I mean it looks cool right don't get me wrong oh yeah ooh that's pretty sick actually huh um let's see if this E would it if it gets the birds Okay, but one thing. Wait, ready? Huh, not bad. But. <laughs> um, yeah, not, not a total fan of the scythe thing. It looks fine, it's just. Dude, her turning her signature into a scythe is so cool. Yeah, I mean, this weapon. This weapon's probably gonna be good for her as well. That's pretty sick, actually. Whoa. She should. Oh, I think it'd be cooler if she was like holding the weapon and flying with it. But I mean, like I'm saying, at the end of the day, this is still a really cool design. Uh, ooh, real quick, which glider do we want for her before we do the last ascension? I don't know if I have one that really fits her. This is fine. Do I want to give her the? I have this on Child and Ryo. They should wait. They should let us spin them around in in here with the glider because I don't want to wait for them to turn all the way around. No. Maybe that. Probably this. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, regular plunge attack. That's. Okay, that's pretty standard. Let's go ahead and just. Okay, she's not leveled, so we're going to see what she does with, like, level 0 talents. Well, it's level 1, but level 1 talents. And Don't worry, guys. We are not going to full-on 
mess with this right now. We just want to see what the damage is looking like. So just our own personal damage. We're going to, I believe, uh, we'll do, we'll do that. That won't affect anything. Oh, no charge attack. <laughs> okay, so you go, and then you let it hang out for a sec. Look at all that uh, bond of life she has at the bottom. Uh, I mean, the damage isn't crazy. And then, apparently you do this, and it's supposed to heal you back up by consuming... Okay, that bond of life at the bottom on the HP bar that you saw. So, she does have a normal charge attack before the dash like that, before she goes. Huh. Okay, uh, that was that was kind of cool, I guess. I don't know, the, the attacks don't hit the same without the scythe. Is the side necessary? No, guys. If you, if you don't have the primos or anything, don't worry about it. Don't feel forced to pull for it. I just really like it because personal preference. That's literally the only reason. So I'm going to go right back and farm this again. Dude, it's in such a weird spot. Look at this. And then let me zoom all the way out. And then now we're just left with this. They're going to put all of Natlin right here. That's a joke, guys, for those of you that just freaked out. Okay, boss fight. Yeah, seeing our damage on level one of the abyss, we're not gonna do that right now. <laughs> we're not gonna do this boss fight with that. But I mean, guys, don't don't see that damage and be like, oh, she's bad. Okay, this is what I was trying to do last time. There you go, that one better. You got an 80k swings there at the end. Oh my gosh. It's getting to the point where we have too many characters. We need to have like folders for characters. <laughs> you know, like all at the top and then. You can like set, oh, I want these DPS characters in this folder, these supports in this. Especially, especially when you're not used to her head. Like, yeah, I was looking for her long ponytail, but okay. Oh, she ascends with crit damage. I think, what's that? The only other pole arm that does that, does Sino do that? I think Hu Tao does. Dude, should I just... No. In case I get her weapon, I don't want to run out of <laughs> weapon enhancement material. Okay. We head back to Mondstadt for a second. Then we're going to level our talents, and then we'll call it a day. But, just want to say thank you all so much for watching, and then if you guys are already tapping out, hope you all had a great time. Yeah, so go ahead and stick around. I'm going to go record that other video right now. It'll probably post in like a day or two of me farming some more artifacts for her. Um, I'm gonna go spend like all my fragile on her right now just because I have all the weapon stuff pretty much farmed And it's mostly <laughs> Like after this it's mostly just um, Waiting to get the weapon and farming artifacts After the boss fight stuff Okay, let's take a quick look at her C1 this Increases 100% as she has interrupting resistance is increased when she performs normal or charge attacks affected uh, wait, what? I wasn't paying attention at all. <laughs> okay, interruption to resistance is increased. Okay, so you get, uh, is it this? Mask of the Red Death, that I saw that. Uh, I think it's just the increase to a normal attack. I don't, okay, here it is, yeah. The bond alive, yeah, so this is just the increase to a normal attack. Instead of 30%, it says, it, um... It gets increased by another 100%, which is fine. Uh, so on release, pretty much the only thing you really want to worry about is her normal attack. And then her E, like what does her E even increase? Spike damage, cleave damage, and the blood that dark damage. Yeah, so on release, when you have like limited of her materials, this is the only thing you really have to worry about. And then kind of just get the E and ult up where it's as necessary as you go. But I kind of have everything for this. So, yeah, let's get these two done. 
Okay. So yeah, I mean, this is this is actually pretty cool. The talent. Oh wait, let's see what these are. I haven't looked at these. Uh, granted a bond of life worth 130% of our max HP. Oh wait. Whoa. whoa, whoa. Is there one an opponent to which she herself apply? What the? <laughs> Dude, it's been a long day. I'm not reading right. And all these crazy words. Okay, granted a bond of life. Okay, so she gives herself bond of life on her max HP. 130% of her max HP. Um, five seconds after is applied. To blood that do. Okay, so I think this is pretty much if you kill them in the setup, you get your bond of life back. I think that's what that is. 1% all elemental and physical resistance for attack. Okay, so she's kind of glass cannony, I've heard. So this kind of just gives you more uh, elemental resistance. Gains 40% pyro damage bonus and can only be healed through Bale Moon Rising. So that's like a free pyro goblet. They're like, you can't be healed, but we'll give you an extra pyro goblet main stat. That's a pretty good trade for Zhang Li mains. That hair is actually pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of KFC or like Chicken Little. I didn't say that. <laughs> okay, but oh yeah, look at that. I looked at the time and it's already 21 minutes. I was just complaining about it being 10 minutes. Okay, we'll get these towns up to six. Yeah, that was uh, that pulling session. I mean, it was fine. Um, <laughs> We had to go close to pity the first time. We missed it the second time. Uh, and we didn't miss it. We got it pretty early the second time, which was good. But like I'm saying, it's we could have used those last like 20, 30 pulls or whatever on the weapon. But like at the end of the day, we got her, so it's not the end of the world. Uh, but yeah, I think we pretty much want to end it here. I'll go do one more boss fight after the. No, wait, I'm going to go record the farming video after this. What is it giving me? Defeat four opponents with overload in two seconds. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, it tells you every time you get a new avatar now. That's cool. You guys, oh yeah, look at this. This is part of the new update, all these new ones. Oh, it's, uh, it's the girl, Jet, that's her name. What am I missing? Oh, I have this guy, but I don't have the quest complete. Same thing, I have that guy. What's that, a Melazine? Don't know who that is. Uh, that's the main fish NPC girl. Another Melazine. No idea what that is. Uh, and that's something I might have seen. Okay, um, yeah, so I'll say thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you guys all have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. See ya.